All right, here we go. All the cars looking pretty good here at this moment. So Cavalier Autonomous Racing, or car. That seems pretty fitting, doesn't it? All right, we're coming to start finish, and this will be it. We are green. The first ever multi-car racing exhibition with more than two cars for a simple passing drill on the track is underway. That looks like Cavalier Autonomous trying to get down and make the pass. Don't think they got it done. They were going for the high line here, but now they do. They flow a little bit more speed. And I think Cavalier Autonomous just picked up second. They did. Getting around Unimore. That word from the engineers in race control. Keist is out of push to pass. Now they got a 10 second lead as they used that push to pass. Just be very smooth for these last six laps. See whether Cavalier or Unimore has enough push to pass to take a run at them here. Let's see. Unimore had gotten it down to two seconds on that last lap. Look at this. Cavalier. Boy, they got some, uh, they put some push to pass. Both Cavalier and Unimore did. That gap has gone from 10 seconds to four, oh, just under five. Now look at Cavalier. Look at that. 106 they just went to. This is it. This is a moment here. They dive down. They had the extra push to pass. And look at that car. It's hunting a little bit. But we have a pass for the lead. Cavalier Autonomous Racing has gone by on Keist. Keist used up their push to pass. Cavalier Autonomous had some left, put it to use late in the run. And now look at, look at Unimore running down low. Do they still have something? Do they have enough to push Keis back just a little bit? Here they come. Unimore going through as we complete 16 to 24 to go. And after leading the whole race, Keis has suddenly dropped to third. And we are working lap 19 of 20. Unimore up over 100 miles an hour. Well, Cavalier, now Cavalier drops the hammer up at 103, almost 104. As they turn in here. Now Unimore, look at that, 105, 106. As they come around here, and we are coming up to start the final lap of this historical exhibition for Indy Autonomous Challenge. I think that margin's gone up just a little bit. Yep, 2.2. And that was Cavalier. As soon as Unimore picked the pace up, that Cavalier car responded and pushed a little bit more on the push to pass. So it all comes down to this lap. What does Unimore have left? Do they have enough push to pass to be able to make a real attack here? Does Cavalier Autonomous have enough left to defend? Just got word, Cavalier is out of push to pass. But where is Unimore? Do they still have some? Yes! Unimore up all at 100 miles an hour. Look at a high. Cavalier got there. Unimore pushing, finding a little bit of pace, running a little bit quicker. Now they're back at the same speed. But if Unimore's got anything, they need it now. Here they come! Unimore coming to the line! They are gonna win it! Unbelievable! They read their push to pass, used it to perfection. 